account, this way, airport has some of the highest health needs in New Zealand today. We have a third of hospital admissions are potentially avoidable with some of the highest rates of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, depression, heart failure, and particularly young people heart failure, cardiovascular disease, and diabetes. We have an obesity epidemic which is out of control. The response from the, the government and from the Counties Manica District Health Board and the local PHOs is the Chronic Care Management Programme. Since 2000, the Chronic Care Management Programme has been leading the way nationally in the area of managing people with chronic disease. From a population base of 440,000, there are now 8,200 people enrolled on the programme. And 79% of general practices now actively participate in the Chronic Care Management Program, or CCM. CCM also targets the high needs population. 70% of people enrolled in CCM are defined as Māori and Pacific. The Chronic Care Management Program connects patients with greater networks of support. It provides additional resource to practices to better manage people at risk. It puts the patient back in charge of their own health. So we want to prevent people from getting sick. We want to give people the tools to recognise when things are going wrong for them and to intervene early so they don't actually end up in hospital. Individual action plans keep patients as well as possible and encourage them to take a more active part in their own health care. Part of the programme is this funding for four GP visits through the year, spread out through the year, and also up to six hours of practice nurse time to see the patient, to engage the patient and to work on wellness and uh, self-management strategies. A broader aim of the scheme is to educate not only the individual, but the whole family. We've got to involve everyone in the management of their care, because often the patient with a chronic condition isn't the person who's doing the cooking. And there's an increasing sort of international move now towards having a coaching relationship with the patient as opposed to having a sort of medical professional advisory role with patients. The CCM programme delivers a continuum of care by integrating various services. CCM helps facilitate changing provider behaviour from acute episodic care to structured case management. It also empowers primary care by secondary outreach and training, electronic decision support and regular reporting on progress. If we could support and empower people to manage their chronic conditions more effectively, we could reduce mortality in New Zealand substantially, improve people's quality of life, and in general, we'd have a better community. They've got fast food restaurants everywhere you turn. People are much less active than they've ever been before. People are younger and younger are putting on weight and getting bigger and bigger. And with all the complexity that comes along with obesity, we have, we have a, a, an ethical and a moral duty, I believe, to take on chronic care management head on.